Hey guys, good morning. Today we are <coughs> gonna watch um, Houston Police Chase, September 29th, 2020. Take one, and bam, thumbnail. Bam. I'm closing now. helicopters up here two police helicopters going in the wrong direction near I-45 and Telephone Road yes copy thanks Hold on, we're live. What'd you say? We're live. We're close to Houston Hobby Airport. It's a little hard following him, but with all the incoming traffic. driver
look at that police officer trying to do a pit maneuver and trying to put this truck and it comes to an end. This chase has been going on for about 10 to 15 like minutes or so. Male driver from what I've been able if to see. you're new to my YouTube channel, please subscribe. Also, we're asking for 100,000 subscribers to our new YouTube channel. Thank you. I'll keep you updated. So, let's listen on. Let's listen on. And again, this all unfolding uh, near the airport, so some shots may be kind of hard for us to get. We're in the final, coming up on Wayside. Wayside and I-45, just south of uh, 610 Coming up on South Wayside, I-45. And coming up on Loop 610. 610 South Loop and Wayside. South Loop. South Loop. South Loop. 610 Wayside on coming up on 610, South Loop, 610 Wayside. Westbound. westbound. They've been chasing me for about 5 to 10 minutes. For the last HPD 5 minutes or so. Uh, and we have two airships up here in the air. Probably. Probably. Uh, probably about last 10 minutes or so. 10 minutes later. The pursuit Back has been the going on. And South Loop, 10 minutes later Wayside. again. 10 minutes later. The pursuit has started. Maybe change him for about 15 minutes or so. Following along, this chase started on the southeast part of Houston, uh, with HPD following behind them. Uh, we have been following this vehicle for about 15 minutes. Allegedly, uh, the suspect stole this vehicle, a pickup truck. Police uh, have been following behind him again for about 15, 20 minutes, on and off the freeway. They've been following him behind him again for about 10 to 20 minutes or so. 15 to 20 minutes or so. We've seen several Let's listen now. misses. As he's gotten off the freeway, on and off the freeway. And he's exiting off of the freeway at Holmes. Getting off at Holmes. They, they've been chasing him for about 20 minutes or so. For the, that's the, this pursuit has been going on for about 15, 20 minutes or so. So. opposite direction just made a u-turn from Griggs heading back to the 610 south loop 
and turning around again. Heading northbound towards Griggs from the 610 South Loop. That's all. Please subscribe to my channel. My channel. We are gonna be going to our channel. No, that's fine. I've got, I've got a usable shot. It's fine. Morning, Monica. He just turned off of Griggs. He turned left on Griggs Avenue Street. He's at your six o'clock. <coughs> It's at your um, one o'clock behind those trees. One o'clock, yeah. And Back towards 45, the Gulf Freeway. Crossing over I-45.
he's got to go right here as well. So he's the only son right here. Hundred dollars subscribers. Oh, I have a wide sign. It's happening right again. It's happening on it two times. 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 Telephone Road, back on Telephone Road, heading to uh, the Gulf Freeway. south of Telephone Road. This is where this chase started, southeast part of Houston. Looks like he's going in the wrong direction. That's southbound 45, trying to turn around and head the wrong way. We have two police helicopters up above. We have numerous HPD officers on the ground. And again, he's heading northbound in the southbound direction of the Gulf Freeway, heading back towards Telephone Road. This is where we picked up the chase, reportedly for a stolen vehicle. From what I can see, it looked to me that it was a male driver uh, in this pickup truck. Again, allegedly a stolen pickup truck who's been driving erratically several near misses and now you can see uh, caught in a parking lot here uh, near a gas station. So many times it looked like the driver was boxed in but was able to maneuver his way around as he's doing right now and you can see how many police officers are behind him. 
on the feeder road of the Gulf Freeway heading southbound towards Telephone Road. Again, they've been chasing me for about 25 minutes or so. It's about 30 minutes into the chase. He's going on the wrong way. He turned around several times. He turned around several times. And he turned around so many times and several times, several times as well, as usual. Several times, several times. So turn right again. Turn the 15 times. The driver has been pretty much sticking uh, to the same area, just driving around in circles. Southeast Houston driving did make his way uh, up towards NRG road. for a short pre uh, time and then turned around. And again, this is sort of where we picked up the chase on the southeast side. And that's where he seems to be sticking around on the side streets going in the wrong direction at times, but again, police tell us uh, that this is possibly a stolen vehicle, and that's how this chase started. The chase has started. The chase has started. started about 10 to 20 minutes ago. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Back under the freeway, I-45, the Gulf Freeway, <laughs> heading north east. This is going over about 35 minutes ago. That's going over about 35 minutes. 35 minutes later, he turned around. I'm going to call 35 minutes later again. He turned out to several streets. I'm going over about 35 minutes. I'm going over about 40 minutes. He's trying to maneuver his way around. He almost got back to for about 40 minutes. And in the meantime, he's watching. Subscribe to my channel. And hit the bell button. And check out this video pops up here. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye guys. I'm leaving you this morning with a video reaction of the free space video. Thank you. Thank you guys. And I'll see you later in the next video. Later on today. Bye guys. It looks like they might be performing the pit maneuver here shortly, trying to get to the uh, rear of the vehicle, usually performed under 40 miles per hour, where they just tap the back of the vehicle. Just crossing Lawndale. And again, in the wrong direction. Riding the median and going in the wrong direction. And it looks like a, a, we do have an accident here. The first accident that I have seen, he's hit another vehicle. As numerous police officers are behind him, it looked like it might be coming to an end right now. Again, collided with another vehicle going in the wrong direction. Smoke coming from the vehicle. Yes, it appears to be over. They do have him uh, handcuffed, several people handcuffed, two in custody, two in custody.